Hey guys, Paperclip here again, gonna be playing some more EU4 today as Florence, where things are going fairly well. They are going fairly well. Um, this is a whole new recording session, so I don't even remember what the hell I was even doing. This guy's becoming loyal. Are we improving relations with him? We are not. We probably should start improving relations with him. Integration of these guys, 20.4%. Okay, that's pretty good. We got a pretty damn big army still going on. Okay, okay, I'm remembering where I'm at. How are we doing on the manpower stuff? I remember we were building that up. We get another one over here. Do we have loans? No, we don't have loans. Okay, perfect. So. There we go. Um, who are we looking to attack? I think Savoy. Yeah, we were just going to try and get this coalition down and then attack Savoy, I think is what we were doing. There's all the pop-ups for new stuff that just happened. Bunch of trade disputes and stuff, it's fine. Who are my longtime rivals? Ottomans, I should probably be embargoing the Ottomans. And who else? Muscovy. I should probably embargo Muscovy as well. Alright, so... We get the conscripted garrisons, or... But yeah, I guess we pretty much should do this. There's like no reason not to. Because... We're going to get a lot more of this. I should also have one of these guys. I don't know why I don't. How much do we pay in land maintenance? Quite a bit. So this guy will basically pay for himself. Nice. So that helps. They're still in the coalition against me as well. Now Spain is not in the coalition against me and they're only allied to Bohemia. Gascony is allied with England and Brittany. I mean he does have a claim on that. I would like to give him Cahors. If I could give him all three of these. I would be ecstatic. You know what? Let me bring some people over here and see if we can't make this happen. So France is at 64. Who else are we doing? Ravensburg? 39. He'll probably leave it pretty soon, so I'm not too worried about him. You know what, just go back up to a really high speed, because I want this to be done with. But I want to have the best chance of him leaving the coalition as well. Alright, looks like in the next month. Or end of this month. Alright, so let's see. England and Brittany will definitely join. We could bring in Milan. Might not be a horrible idea to do that. We definitely still don't have the strongest navy, but we do have a pretty strong navy. I want to go ahead and get a bunch of war galleys being built up.
we go. 14 more galleys. Let's go ahead and roll our king. He's okay. Alright, so if we go to war now over Cahors, we could give it to Toulouse. To be honest, I really see no reason why we wouldn't do this. We still have relations with Burgundy up pretty well. Poland's up pretty good, and Hungary's up fairly good. Milan is not that great, but... Oh, well. You know what, what the hell? Do it. Let's see what the war looks like. 40, yeah, we definitely have the superior troops. I'm not worried about this. Yep, that's fine. Burgundy would like to rent us troops for nothing. Yeah, that's fine. We'll do that. Throw 15 at him and then reinforce with a little bit more. We don't have a general, but we're going to have so many troops here that I'm really not worried about it. You see, that went perfectly fine. And all you just go smash him. Alright, you guys go back there. There we go. On um, pause. really don't want him to die so we're gonna take a little bit of a hit can't believe he did 20 how many troops is this this is 20 troops he gave me it's a lot of troops Milan wants to rent Condottieri to me. Thank you, Milan, but I think I'll be okay. Let's go ahead up in speed, because this is going to be a pretty quick one, I think. I mean, England bringing troops over is really, like, the only potential threat I could see. See, like that. That I see as a potential threat, but... It's not that big of a deal. I just realized I was being dumb. I could have had all of these guys together the whole time, and it would have been fine. We are currently working on trying to get our uh, Diplo up, correct? Yes, so we need another diplomatic candidate. And I honestly think I should probably even focus on Diplo. because I'm probably going to be taking a diplomatic idea group anyway. I'm probably going to take influence. Yeah, I think so. I think I'm going to take influence after this. When do I get that? I will get that at Admin Tech 14, so it's going to be a while, but that's fine. Go ahead and put that guy there. Go get rid of him.
So the coalition's a lot smaller than it was. Can't really do much to Bosnia to convince him to leave. But I definitely kind of want to eat like Ragusa and Bosnia. I don't think it would piss off too many people over here if I did that. He's still out with Hungary though, but we could definitely get Ragusa pretty easily. You know what? Do I have access through you? I don't. I can get it though. You 15.2, come over here. You start building up a spy network over in Ragusa. Because that's actually not a bad province, so I would like to have it. See, that's hills, though. I really don't want to attack them in the hills. So I think I'm just going to go and siege his capital. Spain has entered the coalition against us. Okay, see, now this is pretty bad. That I don't like. Because Spain is pretty damn powerful. Kill him. Kill him. I say they're really destroying our ships. We have way more ships. We shouldn't be losing any ships. It's ridiculous. We shouldn't have lost anything. Alright, so I would really like to just see what I can get off him. Now if I took those, it doesn't really matter which one I take it seems. I think I'd rather take the one up here so that way Burgundy can't come down here and get it. So I think this is going to be our peace deal. Alright, we're going to go in and attack him here in just a second. Why don't you just go kill that three stack real quick? Thank you. Now come back over here. And you're just going to go in. Awesome. So this is in the bag. Would France give me access? He would. Thank you, France. Such a cool guy. I'll just walk right through Spain. I didn't know I'd be able to do that. Why can't I do that? Do that. 
Should build some more buildings. Do I have all the trade ones done? I think so. Looks like it. Let's get another one of you over here. And all you guys come over to here. Leave one guy here. Is he willing to accept this piece yet? No. Okay, so we keep going. Until he is willing to accept that piece. We're almost at 30% with Languedoc, or not with Languedoc, but Toulouse. Alright, so what we want to do now is fabricate a claim on that. Say okay, wait a day, come here, give them this guy. They have no friends. We can easily declare war and take Trubovnik. I see no reason to not do it. Maine has come under the occupation of Brittany. They now control it. Oh. I definitely felt like Maine in freaking the United States when I heard that. It's like, what do you mean they're over in Maine? Take the prestige. You guys protect trade. Should we do it in Genoa? I think we do it in Venice actually. Just because it'll take money away from Venice. And Milan. Alright, are you willing to take this now? You are. Perfect. Did you also give me war reps? No. How much money will you give me? 176. This adds in the Palatinate, Baden, that's it. But I don't want a bunch more people to join this, preferably. I think I'm going to do it anyway and just risk it. There we go, so Cahors and Limousin. Really, that costs more just because I'm giving it to my vassal instead of taking it myself? And now it's going to cost me Diplo points as well? That's freaking dumb. 
That's very dumb. He's my vassal. That makes no sense. I mean, whatever. Alright. So we do have a good amount of aggressive expansion over here. We do have pretty much southern France all guaranteed to be ours. It's going very well. This will angry Bosnia. And that's about it. So yeah, we're definitely going to do that. We're definitely going to take all your money. We're definitely going to feel good about it in the morning. It's not going to work. Because now that he has Spain supporting his independence... He's like furious. Even though I basically formed Tripoli for him, he's still furious. Hungary, Austria, Poland, Burgundy, and Milan, and me though, is a pretty powerful force. And I don't think they want to mess with it. I really don't think that's in their better interest to try and mess with it. Let's see. Switzerland is not going to leave that coalition. Maybe Morocco will. If we improve relations with Morocco. Alright, so he's working on coring this one already. need your Kandatiari anymore, man. Thank you, though. Okay, so let's go ahead. Core it. It is already in an area that we have a state there, so it'll automatically get a real nice state-level core on it. Slowly but surely, we're spreading this beautiful red color. It's like a pinkish red. I kind of want to just finish this idea. Yeah, we're just going to finish this idea. So now I get extra manpower, less land attrition, and an extra 50% to my force limit, which means I can now have 85 troops. And I have the economy to be able to afford to have most of those troops. So the thing I'm going to do. Is start working on that. Sixteen to eight. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So that'll give him sixteen to six, and then I'll have to build two more cannons, and then I can do that on the other one. And that'll give me what, seventy eight thousand troops?
The nation of Milan, your faithful allies, requesting that you come to their aid in the second Milanese conquest of Kuno against Savoy. I tell you what, I will help you, but I definitely expect you to give me some shit in this war. I'm going to be pissed off. There we go. So I already have the majority of the participation. What I can do is tell this guy to go away so he doesn't just make me suffer attrition. Decap these guys and throw them up there. Because that'll help us actually get progress here too, just like him. A diplomat from Botan has been discovered building a spy network? Why? Why would you build a spy network on me? That makes no sense. That makes no sense at all why he would bother to do that, but whatever. Well, so far so good. You two should come up here. And then you guys. Two, three, four, five, six. We'll start working on their cannons as well. Probably start trying to see if I can't minimize some of this coalition. How is Morocco? Morocco is still fairly angry with us. That's mainly because we blocked any route of expansion that he had by doing this to Tripoli. Dude, you are such a piece of crap. You are such a piece of crap. This isn't even funny anymore. He just keeps taking the provinces I need over and over again. Oh, I can't wait to kill you, Milan. I cannot wait to kill you. It is going to happen. Probably soon. Probably very soon. Unfortunately, Hungary would aid him. Who are you friends with? Uh, you're part of the coalition, so we really can't attack you at the moment. Is he cooling this now? Yeah, he is. Perfect. I mean, I could attack Tunis and give Tripoli more land, but that's just going to make him stronger and make his independence supported by Spain even more of a risk. Probably isn't the best place to sit. No, that's fine actually. I 
think that's what we need. I don't want to do too much more because our manpower will be completely gone and then we won't be able to actually reinforce our units. All this land is such good development too. The lowest is 11, but all the others are almost 20 if not over 20. We're going to go Diplomat again, just to try and help catch this up. There we go, 78,000 troops. We took some more land for Toulouse. We took Ragusa for ourselves. So the East Adriatic is starting to come together. Freaking Portugal like basically doesn't exist. This is a very interesting campaign. Muscovy's losing. Crimea's staying fairly strong. Denmark annexed Norway, Sweden is independent but getting beat up by a lot of people, Novgorod still exists, somehow, Tver and Ryzen still exist, it's very strange, it's very strange indeed, but anyway, I think I'm going to go ahead and call this an episode here, so thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode, but until then, bye bye